Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Chesley. So today I wanted to talk about the things that I use that helped me pass the registry. I got a 90% on my registry um, back in June. These are the things that, that I use that helped me pass. So stay tuned. So the first thing that I used was this thing called Correct Tech. And I'm sure if you're a senior right now, they've already given you Correct Tech, most likely. So with Correct Tech, basically, um, there's different sections, of course, like anything. There's different sections, there's multiple questions, and it is multiple choice. And basically, you just, you know, choose whatever's right. There is also four exams. So those have like 200 or like 220-something questions, I think. And those are also really helpful because as you're taking it, they don't give you the answer. Like once you get it wrong or once you get it right, they don't give you the answer. So basically it's like taking the actual registry and um, that's really helpful because you can't, on the registry, they're not going to tell you if you got the answer wrong or right, right then and there. You have to wait till the end to get your score. So um, I felt like that was really helpful. The only thing with Correct Tech, I felt like Compared to all these other things that I'm going to mention, Correct Tech was a little bit too easy compared to all the other ones because the other ones were super hard. But I'm not saying Correct Tech is bad because I still love Correct Tech. Like, um, they explain it once you get it wrong, and that's really helpful. So, the second thing that I used was HESI. So, HESI has, you know, a radiology or a radiography um, section, and Basically, our school gave us that too with the correct tech and girl, HESI is hard. The H stands for hard, okay? And HESI, um, I'm not gonna lie, HESI was the hardest thing that I took, but I felt like the HESI was most like um, the registry more than anything. And I'm so glad one of my classmates, Jordan, she's the one that told me that um, because she had taken her registry like a month or two before mine and she told me like the HESI is just like the registry make sure you keep studying the HESI until you get like an 80% on each exam and girl when I tell you I was doing that HESI like every single day every single day I stop so number three is this book right here radiography prep so this is um actually a book that our school gave us um, and on the back, you can see here, there is a Q&A version of this book. Oopsies. There is a Q&A version of this book, and there's flashcard versions of this book. So, we only got the book, which is okay, because I feel like the book really helped. A couple classmates of mine, they did get the flashcard ones, and that was good for them. And, um, in this book, it actually has a 200-question test in the back, and I've taken that, like, two or three times and um when I took it I got a 73% on it and that was like maybe like two days or the day before I took my actual registry and I was freaking out because I thought it was stupid or something but if you can get a 73 on this thing you're gonna do really well on the registry because <laughs> look this is where I am here I am no I'm just kidding but anyways another thing is like if you look in the back of this book it tells you to sign up for Rad Review Easy, and they give you a free version of Rad Review Easy. So Rad Review Easy is actually number four of this video, and Rad Review Easy is hard and very, very challenging, and you can choose your difficulty levels, and it always explains to you. Sometimes, though, I've noticed on Rad Review Easy, sometimes their answers are wrong, and you have to dispute with them people like, excuse me, that's not what the book says. Yeah, if you just get this book, it'll give you the option, or you can always sign up for Rad Review Easy Free, and it gives you, like, the, um, little link right here. And, yeah, basically, that's really what I used, and honey, like I said, I got a 90%. At the end of the day, like, it was definitely God that helped me during this exam, because, girl, when I tell you, when I was taking my registry, I started crying, because I was so scared, and I just... At that point, I was like, I failed because I don't know what the heck these people are asking me. Oh, the registry is the hardest thing I've ever done in my whole life. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Bye.